talent at the back. So we just really can't wait to see those guys ball and get the rock in their hands. Yeah, they're behind you. A couple linebackers making plays. C.J. Allen doing what he did. Braylon Wilson leading the team to tackles. What do those guys mean to this team? And how can you provide and help them out? Now, we got some real good young guys at the linebacker position that are going to come in and step up and show up, like kind of how those guys are doing. Uh, they guys, they guys are huge for the team, and we appreciate everyone they do. With no, Ma with no uh, Malachi out there, no Small out there today, is it Elder States now on this defense? Do you feel the need to step up and make plays like you did today? Uh, so I don't really. I want to say I feel the need because because how the defense is, like you, like everybody's going. If you do what you're supposed to do, the play going to come to you. Is what we say. So I always say I feel the need, but it feels great to go out there and actually make the play. And then you know, guy, your guy moved more to the outside linebacker position today. How'd you feel in, in playing that new role and obviously getting the interception that you had? I felt great. I felt great, man. Just, just building confidence in it. Mm. Did you, you walk you, me through that interception and sort of what you saw and just sort of how the play unfolded for you? Uh, I believe I was looping to contain, and then I seen Carson getting ready to uh, get ready to, to load and throw it. So I kind of just laid it back to a drill. Coach Scott has a dude with three step, three step, quick five, and uh, got the bat the ball. Tried to find the ball in the air. Uh, came down with the interception. You said you want to uphold the standard as an upperclassman now. How would you describe that standard for the defensive line? Just, just by not allowing any, uh, what's the word? I know a word, but uh, any uh, board jump. Like, like just, <laughs> just don't, just don't, we, we just plan to the Georgia Standard, like, run defense is going to be the same. Like, just remembering how Nolan and those guys uh, held me to the standard and doing the same to those guys, what I mean. Gabe Harris got a lot of playing time today. Yeah. What have you seen out of him this spring, especially as he seemingly you know plays outside linebacker, plays defensive end for you guys? Yeah, Gabe been grinding, man, and uh, he gonna he gonna you know you kind of seen it today. It's gonna it's gonna continue to work work out and uh, show off for him. So Gabe Gabe's been doing his thing. Was the run defense today kind of what you guys are showing throughout the spring? You feel like? Uh, it was it wasn't really much much running the ball today uh, compared to what we've been seeing. So I can't really give you an honest answer on that. Uh, because they didn't really run it as much as they as they've been doing. But I feel like, like right now, just coming out of the game, I feel like we kind of played the run kind of well. We probably we always could do do better and improve on it, but I feel like we did kind of well in the run game. How simple was the defense today in terms of what you guys could do? Did they kind of keep things pretty vanilla? Or yeah, yeah, pretty vanilla. Yeah. Pretty much. So, you mentioned not a ton of running, but those running backs got involved in the pass game. What did you see out of Trevor and? Andrew and Roderick as they were out there today? Uh, kind of what they've been showing all spring, just the quickness and the ability to make you miss in space. Walk me through the interception. I know you tipped it to yeah. yourself. Yep, yeah, I just looped four to five, tipped it, turned the ball in the air, and came down with it. He's been constantly growing, man. He's been growing since last year. Like, he always came in with that motor and that attitude about himself to work, and uh, just to see it pay off on the day has been great. I had the interception, but there are a couple other plays too where we all got an arm up and batted and passed out the line of scrimmage. How important it is for y'all to, you know, generate those opportunities and make those kind of disruptive plays in the line? It's extremely important because that's something we preach. We preach havoc, and havoc, and havoc includes batted balls. So as long as we keep batting them, man, it's, it's, a, it's a win for us. Michael, can you talk about that play, that the, the tip and the catch? Have you made that sort of play before? And uh, I mean, just how quickly did you spot the ball in the air? Uh, I think this is the first time I came down with pick, but uh, I tipped the ball before. But uh, it took me probably like about two or three seconds to find it. I thought I thought I looked up, so I thought I found I just came down with it. And what? how did you break down your snaps today? Between the, did you just play one spot or were you playing both today? No, I played multiple. I played. Uh, I played. I say it's probably around like. About 50 50 almost like Jack defense and end. Then I, I moved this side to play the little D talking on third down, too. What did you see out of Joseph this spring? I know he's a guy that kind of shadowed you at times, had a sack there late. Mm -hmm. uh, Joseph, you know, he, uh, he's going to continue to grow and, and be a great player for us. Uh, he, he definitely has the ability and the work ethic, so I just can't wait to see what he, I just can't wait to see what he do. I feel there were some questions about this defensive line over mm -hmm. the course of spring. Just how much confidence do you have in this program for you guys to be able to oh, yeah. go out there? Yeah, I have supreme confidence in our group, and I feel like we're going to keep on working and being better and, uh, and, and perfecting our weaknesses, and I feel like we're going, to, we're going to be a good group this year. What did you see from the group as a whole in this group? Uh, just the fight, and then and then how we was able to get pressure and able to bat balls, cross havoc, so I've seen a lot of good things out of our group. Talking through the celebration after the pick. <laughs> Uh, we got that from the Pittsburgh, the Pittsburgh Steelers. Uh, if you watch T.J. White, he got an interception. He threw it up. He shot it down. Kyle shoomed up. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Could you could you explain those two positions again? I, I came in a little late that you were talking about. Mm -hmm. uh, defensive hand, that's more hand in the dirt. Uh, in our system, that's more hand in the dirt. While outside linebacker is more standing up. That's kind of the difference in between in a, in a, in a two in our in our system. So will you do any more end, or is it pretty much all in on the jack now? Oh, no, yeah, I'm doing both, yes, sir. I cross-train and do both. Did it depend on the, the play? 
it, uh, it kind of does, but it kind of doesn't. So we have different personnel so where it doesn't matter what the offense calls, but we have some stuff to, that caters to the offense. Was there – was the way y'all played, I guess, until the last possession when they tied it, mm -hmm. was this kind of the defense getting the better of the offense, kind of just finishing strong, or what, did it reflect I like said, some spring progress mm -hmm. for the defense? Yeah, it was definitely progress today. And I said I won't really have a real answer to you until I watch the film and uh, know exactly how we really played and like and, and, uh, and what were the bust and, and how we gave up plays. So that's when I get you. All right, Michael, that's the right answer. But how do you, you stand in front of us smiling. How do you feel the defense? I know that you're going to watch the film and it's yeah. going to be breaking down, but do, do you walk off that field feeling like you guys got the better of it? I feel like I feel like we kind of won the day in a way. But uh, it's definitely not to the standard because we gave up 21 points. Sure. But, but I feel like I feel like we kind of held our own today. All right, thank you.